But good morning. Thank you all for being here. Appreciate you all taking time out of your busy schedules to be here today as we start a new chapter in Havelina football. Now, before we get to the man of the hour, I'd like to invite up Executive Director of Athletics and Campus Recreation, Steve Roach, to say a few words. All right, good morning, everyone. This is fantastic. Thanks, everyone, for coming out. This is an exciting day for this department, for this university, and for this program. So I'm thrilled that everyone has come out to see it. So um, I want to start with a few thank yous. Um, first and foremost, I want to thank the search committee in this process. Um, we had a six or seven person search committee that uh, combed through a lot of applications, a lot of uh, candidacies, and they did a fantastic job. They sacrificed a lot of their own time. Some folks in that committee were not university employees, so they are traveling down here or up here and uh, really spending a lot of their own time to help this process and to run a good search. So I want to thank the search committee. I want to thank our president, Dr. Mark Hussey, who could not make it here today due to previous engagements. I want to thank him for his support throughout this process and for uh, making this happen in this time frame. So that being said, with the search process, um, we had a fantastic applicant pool. We had over 140 applicants apply for this position. And um, combing through those, we took that down to 10 of those folks, received uh, online Zoom interviews that we did a few weeks before Christmas. So we did 10 of those, and then we brought three of those uh, candidates on campus. And what we were really looking for in this process is, um, a new head coach, this is such an important hire, but a new head coach who recognizes that winning is important on the field and off the field. We're looking for program and culture development. We're looking for a person who come in and in four or five years make sure our student athletes are graduating, that they're having a great opportunity to win, and that they've increased their um, off the field development socially to prepare them for life after graduation. So we think it is full circle and very important to make sure we win football games, but we win football games and develop our student athletes so they leave here better than when they came. So that was one of the big missions. And I'll say this, from the start of this process, from the Zoom interviews forward, Coach Salinas checked every box of that criteria. We did the Zoom interviews and he did a fantastic job. And he rose right to the top after the Zoom interviews. And then we brought uh, three candidates on campus. All three candidates were high quality candidates that could have done a good job. But Coach Salinas was our first on campus candidate and he just came in and it was like he knew, I mean, he was just reading what we wanted. And it was not, he didn't know that. He was telling us things, how he wants to run his program. And it just meshed perfectly with what we were looking for. So I'm excited for him to get here. Coach has a plan to build this program. He knows the work involved. We have a lot of work to do with this program. Coach is aware of it and he has a good game plan in place to make sure we get where we need to go and we do it the right way. So that being said, um, Coach is all about our student athletes developing. Coach is about our student athletes graduating. And one of the things that I like to stress is at the end of four years, we want our student athletes to walk across that stage, to pick up a diploma with a championship ring on their finger or nothing best, they've had the opportunity to compete for a championship. And Coach buys into that. He understands building a program is a long-term process and doesn't happen just overnight, and he is ready to take on that challenge. So um, it's been a great process for us. We're so excited that he was interested in this job. We're excited that um, he was able to get involved in this, and he did such a great job. And that being said, um, I'm going to turn it over to Coach now, but before I want to welcome Coach, his wife Leslie, uh, former Havelinas who have experienced a lot of success here, and we know they're going to bring that success and culture back to uh, the Havelina football program. So without further ado, I'd like to welcome Coach Salinas to the Havelina Athletic Department. Thank you, Steve, and uh, wow, what a great day to be a Havelina, right? Uh, I stand before you today honored and humbled to be your head football coach at Texas A&M University, Kingsville. To all those who have been a part of making this a reality, I am truly grateful. We're looking forward to reestablishing the tradition that is Havelina football. First of all, I want to thank God for the opportunity that he's placed in front of us. Football and this university have meant a great deal to me and a part of who I am. As a staff, we're going to do the best we can to serve this university and this community in all aspects. This is a special place to me and my family. I said I wasn't going to do this, right? Uh, 
And it's a great opportunity to impact and mentor young men at a place that is dear to our hearts because of the impact it had on me as a former player and coach. And for that, we are truly grateful. To my family and friends and all those who have helped along the way, I hope you know how much I appreciate you. Many of you are here today, um, and I want to thank you. I want to thank my mother and father, mom and dad, if you'll stand and be recognized. Thank you for all you've done and all you sacrificed for me and our family. You showed me the value of hard work, the importance of tough love, and for that, I love you. To my wife, Leslie, thank you for all of your love and support. She's also a Havilene alum, and on the record, I'll say she's probably the better athlete. <laughs> thank you for all your support through this journey, and I look forward to taking on this challenge together. To President Hussey, Athletic Director Steve Roach, the Board of Regents, and the Search Committee, thank you for believing in me to run this program. We're going to work tirelessly to make sure you're proud of the program we put on and off the field. To all my former coaches, starting with my father, who coached me in high school, thank you for instilling the values in me that I still use today. To Coach Ron Harms, who gave me an opportunity and took a chance on a kid from the Valley. To Richard Cundiff, Chris Ballard, Haskell Buff, all men who coached me in college, thank you for the foundation you provided in my development as a young man. To Coach Cundiff, who gave a young coach his first college job, it was probably against his better judgment. <laughs> to all my former head coaches I had an opportunity to work for, thank you for the impact you've had on my life and the help you provided in my development as a coach. To all of you men, I am forever grateful. To all of our former players, my former teammates, along with all of our former coaches, we thank you for all that you've done for this great university. We're going to work long and hard to make sure that we honor all those that have come before us and leave a legacy for all those that follow us. To our current players, I look forward to meeting you and I'm excited about getting to work with you and our staff to take Haviland football back where it deserves to be. Our number one priority is going to be to take great care of our student athletes. I believe in sport and in life you win with people. We're going to do that by developing and building intentional relationships with you and challenging you in every aspect of your life. Our job is going to be to help you grow academically, athletically, socially, and spiritually. We're going to go to work to uphold the tradition that is Havilena football. We will understand, we will all understand, that we're part of something bigger than ourselves. And we're going to take great pride in making you proud of what we do in the classroom, on the field, and in our community. Our program is going to be built on three key components, toughness, discipline, and effort. I want to thank you for the opportunity you've given me to lead this program. And I promise you can rest assured that we're going to work like crazy to put a product on the field that all of Havilena Nation can be proud of. On behalf of myself and my family, I thank you for being here today. It means a great deal to us. Um, I greatly appreciate all of you that took the time and effort to be here. Um, we're excited about where we are, excited about where we're going, ready to hit the ground running, ready to get a staff in place to meet our current players and do all the things that we have to do to showcase this great university. Thank you for your time today, and go Hogs.